Entertainment News Oris Willeke, one of Nigeria's pioneer reggae musicians, says there is no need for comparison between artists of the 60s, 70s, 80s and the millennial artists. In an interview with Plus TV News, the producer-songwriter explained that the contents they were producing at the time were mostly to liberate Nigerians from the Gestapo era of military rule. He, presided the, he praised the new artists for putting the country on the world map. We're, com we're coming from a dark age where uh, a lot of people were under pressure, as my brother would say. We were under the military and uh, there was a lot of brutality and we wanted freedom, you know, for democracy. So if you look at the lyrics of content that were coming out of that time, they were unique and perceived to be in one direction, you understand? So we talked about the freedom in South Africa, the liberation of the South Africa, you know. So at the end of the day, you realize that the message people were used to then was this, you know, was the, 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 the words and passion for liberation. So, and it got to a point also where I think the, the airwaves was too saturated with such kind of music. And um, first of all, music comes in, in style and pattern. It comes in fashion, you understand? So it's like a round football. So it goes round like this and it changes with time. And so by the time the youth felt, well, they're tired of this, uh, no light, no water, no this, no this. They wanted something new. And so, they were able to come up with a unique sound, a sound that in our days we were not able to actually, you know, uh, come up with. Because we used to argue, you know, amongst ourselves, do we have a Nigerian music? You know, it was difficult because you cannot say Akpala. It's, it's uh, Nigerian music because it's, un it's unique to a particular section. You cannot say uh, High Life was. From Ghana. From Ghana. You cannot say um, the traditional music that we know because it's not national. So we needed a, a nationalistic sound, which we couldn't get. But today the youth have been able to come up with a unique sound. If you play it in Asia, you say this is a Nigerian sound. If you play it in America, they say this is a song from Nigeria because they've been able to come up with a unique uh, pattern of music that is, is origin, original to Nigeria. The music legend sang one of his popular songs, Mubala Mumbe, explaining that the music is medicinal and the calling to be a musician is not to retire until God calls. When asked if he would like to work with the young ones, he responded this way. God help you if you do not have any physical disability. A musician should play till he enters the grave, you know, because it's a calling. You know, it's not like the civil service where you have uh, uh, number of age uh, that you will serve and then retire. You know, look at King Sonny Adi. He's still bubbling. There is no day he's not on stage. Mm. You think of the energy at 70 something. So it's, 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 it's a unique calling. And with the calling, you realize that your body is aligned to it. You know, if you don't play music for one, two weeks, you, you look sick. You know? uh, if you're looking for an organic sound that is unique to one person, then is the video. You know, I, I, I also work with Bonner Boy because of his creativity. He can take a line from any song and turn it to something else. You know, um, Whiskey is also very good, but Whiskey is more of thinking of the perception of an international artist. And so when he writes his song, he ensures that he embellishes with you know, the, the unique international sound that he thinks is acceptable. The Congratulations uh, for the win, uh, Bonner Boy, uh, because uh, uh, it's something we couldn't do in our days, but, you know, thank God it's your time. So, congratulations. Play me that music of Africa that never grew old. Tell me the history of Africa that's never been told. Africa nice, man is so nice. Africa cool, man is so cool. Africa sweet, man is so sweet. Like the sugar and spice. My bad, take it again. Bumala Mumbe. The saddest song of the time, the saddest song of the future. Instead of drugs, instead of cotton. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.